There we are. All right, Christ's sake. Did someone say let's? Hey, Lugia. <laughs> oh God, you're goofy. Yay! Hey, shovel. So I thought I'd get back into the let's builds. It's been a while, but man, I definitely need to get back into this stuff. So that will be something I will do. Hey, Matthew, what's up? All right. So, um, the goal for today is to be making Uzume's uh, megaphone. I'm going to adjust the, the volume a little bit here on this, because I don't want to listen to it too loudly. But, um, so one of the things I need to do is get some, you know, I'm going to go through my usual cycle, which is gather uh, resources that I need for it, since I really couldn't find any good reference photos to work with. So I had to go quickly launch Mega Dimension and uh, get some reference photos to work with. So you guys get to kind of see what I do here again. <laughs> so, all right, let me go ahead and uh, launch uh, Mega Dimension here so I can go get that. Also, I want to point out, uh, Horny Pastry Puffers is an achievement. <laughs> all right. So, okay, let's see. Hopefully I can... I'm going to switch to a game source here. Give me a second here. I'm gonna quickly disable this for a second, just so we can get this in. Hey, Mikey, what's up? Curse it, please. Thank you. I love these streams. <laughs> Glad you do, man. All right. So I need to get the a few reference photos to work with. So let's go pop into here. Hopefully, even. Uh, yeah, where am I? Okay, okay. Oh, she's away, isn't she? Shoot. Do we not have her right now? Is it because of... Nope, she's right here. <laughs> she's right here. She's, like, fatally wounded, but apparently she's fine. Um, Let's see. Is there any difference? Ooh. Wait, hang on. Oh, that's going to be interesting to do. Um, do you guys want me to do the uh, HDD variant, or do you guys want me to do the standard? I'll let you guys kind of pick that one. I could do either of them, and I probably wouldn't have too much of a problem with it. Excuse me, I hope you don't mind me getting a little close and, close and personal here. Hey, Hawk, are the mods only friends of yours in real life? Um, no. I don't know them that well. HDD. Sticky says HDD. Everyone's saying, all right, I got two for HDD. Uh, there's eight people here, I know that. Not that very much, so let's see here. Do the standard one. Alright, two, two for HDD, one for standard. Let's see here. I'm gonna see if I can get... Let's see if I can get one more. I want at least two more votes. Or I might just do HDD if time passes enough. I'll probably give it like another minute or so for the people that are watching. It's definitely going to be interesting working with, uh... Oh, three for HDD. Okay, so I think it's going to be pretty much decided now. So, HDD variation. This is going to be interesting. Everyone vote. It's alright. Everyone has to. So, this will be a bit more... Ooh, okay, let's see. Standard. Alright, two for standards. One for... Or right, two for standards, three for HDD. I think it's going to be HDD, though. So, let's see... I need to find a good angle to get this, because I'm very limited on my angles here. And no, I'm not trying to sneak a panty shot before anyone asks. Let's see. That's a decent side view. Go ahead and grab this one. Oh, we're tied now. Oh, boy. I'll go ahead and grab... Uh, I, well, actually, hang on. <laughs> I need one more person to vote. I need, I need a tiebreaker. Someone give me a tiebreaker. <laughs> I need a... Guys. Oh, hi, Suicide Prevention Network. Welcome. Normal. Guys. <laughs> We've got 
eight votes and it's split evenly. <laughs> Vote standard. How many do we have now? We are four for four. Okay, no, Sam went, Sam's the tiebreaker. So HDD, there's now nine votes. YouTube makes people kill themselves. Oh, um, all right. Are you here to make sure that doesn't happen, Suicide Prevention Network? <laughs> it's important that people don't do that. So I think I'm just gonna go HDD. I'm gonna go ahead and just call it here. <laughs> Be better if I did that before even more of a tiebreaker happens. Or even more ties happen, so we're just gonna go HDD form here. So I'm, uh, this is a good shot. I'll grab this. Let's see if I can grab the megaphone here. Can I can I zoom in? Yeah, I can. Okay, cool. All right, so I'll get the front end of this. All right, I need to rotate this camera again. Grab that back. Reference is key in this, so you have to really, really, really grab everything you can so you can grab every little last detail. This is definitely going to be a very interesting one to work with. That's kind of interesting how they got that flush there. And one of the things is when I'm working on this, I kind of start to notice how they do the models. I'm going to go do homework. All right, see you, Kapal. Sorry, not sorry. I see. I might come back later. No worries. I think that'll be good for the top. I think that's really all the evidence I can really get. This floating ring is going to be the easiest thing to do because it's a floating ring. It's a Taurus. Screenshotting the maze panties. I am not. This is called image gathering. Any art person knows how this works. Alright, so I think we're good now. I'm not used to hearing Ram's voice dialogue there. Does Orange Heart have a tiny... <laughs> oh, such a big... You don't have to tell anyone. <laughs> Alright, let's switch back out here. Alright, so I should have enough to work with. Let me go pull those up. To work with. Uh, let me get Blender back up here. And I need to grab over here, excuse me. Oh, crap, I forgot. It's this Steam, Steam screenshots are annoying to kind of pull up. Exactly. So give me a second while I pull those up again. Perfect. <laughs> Don't mind me, guys. Alright, so now comes the next big thing, which is kind of figuring out how I want to start this. I think what I might do is come from the side. You are guilty of panty shots. Oh, can you know it? I am not intending to do that. <laughs> Guys, please. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start... Um, he's saving them off screen. Well, I don't think you guys... I think you guys would rather want to see the model being constructed rather than the... Um, what is it? This is the reference photos. It's kind of not exactly what you want. <laughs> of course. Okay, so one of the most important things you got to do is when you start looking at models, you got to see kind of what your print, what your uh, starting shape should be. And what I'm going to do is the front part, kind of where like the speaker is. So I think what I need to do to start with that is work with a. Where is the meshes? There they are, and then go with the cylinder. I think that'll be what I should want uh, should aim for here. And this is not just, uh, <clears throat> this isn't just, uh, Mega Dimension music, so you're going to be hearing a lot more of that, <laughs> obviously. So let's see. Email. Hello, do I have a life, do you? This doesn't seem like you, to be honest. <laughs> So I can't, the only downside to not being able to do this on my own, is, or getting a little bit of a practice in, I won't be able to really accurately get a good representation of it. This looks like it comes in a little bit right here. Let's get that back here. Okay. 
Hi Hawk, do you have any 7 Dimension Neptunia songs in the playlist? Uh, let me check. This is an old playlist and it's not updated, so I don't think it's in yet. I might, uh, add that. I need to add that in, so... I think, uh, since this is probably gonna be- this might be a two-parter, I don't know. If it's a two-parter, I'll definitely get the, uh... I'll definitely add it in, so don't worry about that. So next comes this bit here. I thought you were the Suicide Prevention Network, but the Suicide Causing Network. Vastly different things, unfortunately. Alright, so let's- whoops, not what I wanted to do, actually. Actually, no, that is what I wanted to do. I'm just not paying attention here. So let's see. It needs to be actually a bit larger. So you can kind of start to see that how that shape's coming into play here. I like the theme for the Unreal World theme. I did like a lot of the themes in Cyber Dimension. I actually really wish, uh... Like, I kind of wish I had that playlist right now. Although, I do want to keep the Mega Dimension since... I don't know. <clears throat> it's a lot more of a... Tie to this than Cyber Dimension does. Or are you tying a boat together? That's not how that works. Alright, so this comes out about right there. Looks about right. My mom's boss hunk. Jeez. And it actually kind of looks like here that that goes inside, so that makes sense. Kind of looks like a satellite dish right now, in all honesty. Suicide prevention, please stop, man. I really don't need that right now. This isn't a stream for this kind of stuff, bro. And I will have that. I, I won't let you keep doing this if, you, if you're going to keep just sitting here and doing that, man. Come on. So what I need to do now... Yeah, it's kind of something we really shouldn't be discussing at the moment. Is Uranus, no, not a joke, will be Venus, and the, the scene. <laughs> Is that glorious? <laughs> I don't think so. Let's see here. So I'm just trying to get the general shape in here, get it all tidied up correctly. That looks pretty accurate now. Start the screenshots of the chat. <laughs> that is jinxy. Moogie, yeah, that was all jinxy. Alright, so what I'm going to go ahead and do, since this is probably a good thing to do, let's go ahead and add in that Taurus. So this is where that donut shape is going to kind of come into play here. I can figure out how to shrink the internal bits here. Because I don't think it's supposed to be that thick. Okay, shift S, cursor to center. Selection cursor. What? Wait, what? Blender, what did you do? Okay. That was weird. I didn't think I'd have Blender mess up like that. We're off to a great start. Yeah, Suicide Man, stop it, dude. It's not really... Sm you know, if you're gonna keep playing this game, man, it ain't gonna work out for you. I'm just gonna say that now.
So this is like right here. Yeah, see, that's the one problem I have right now is this is too large. So I can shrink this without adjusting its size. Yeah, I need to shrink this a bit. So let's see here, shrink in the X direction. I haven't really messed with Tauruses. too thick here. Might have to go and actually make this myself. It's currently putting a lampshade on a giant donut. Yeah, that's roughly what that would look like. I don't think this is what we're looking for. Hey, Hog, do you know the way? Yes, I know the way. I know of this meme. This meme is fun. It's a funny meme that I didn't think would ever, like, appear. I'm gonna try something other. Cause the torus works, generally the torus works, but the, it's too big. Unless there's a secret to this here. Uh, and is there an inner radius? Aha. Yes. Whoops, I got rid of it. I am smart. So if I space this out enough, that looks accurate. That's what I'm looking for. Ugandan Knuckles is best meme. Actually, it actually looks like this is larger than it should be. There we go. Is a little smaller, so about right there, maybe. Let's see. Yeah, that looks accurate. What program is this? This is Blender. All my model, all my 3D models are done in Blender. That needs to go up a bit more. Seems pretty accurate. So I do need to add in my control loops now, because I think I'm going to cause some problems when I multi-res. Let's see. Yep. Alright, let's get these in here then. So again, setting up control loops, just to kind of control multi-resolution to some degree. giving it, Adding it to these edges, just to make it so that way they produce this, instead of kind of smoothened out edge. When you switch into object mode, it gives more of that point we're looking for. Same thing I need to do down here. It's kind of important I do that, actually. So the closer we get, the less uh, smooth we're going to have and the more point-based it's going to be. Hey, Hawk, would you ever go on VR chat without a VR... So you can make weapons? Have you tried created a being? I have tried doing uh, organic modeling. I'm not very good at it yet, but I need to, I just need more practice. That's really all that it comes down to at this point. Oh, I need to undo that. Organic modeling is a significantly different thing from hard surface, which hard surface, for, for those of you who aren't really, this is basically what hard surface is. Organic modeling does with anything like life form based. So let's see how this looks now. And I know how to fix this. This adds a lot of faces, or uh, just polys to the general model, so it's not generally the best thing to do. But it does make things a lot easier on everyone. Or at least specifically me. Because no, no geometry gets all janky. Nothing really happens too upsettingly here. <laughs> hey, Logan. As for dude, it's life's question, um, maybe? I don't know. I'm not really sure what to expect on uh, VR chat. I'd rather wait till I have a VR headset because I'm told it's actually it actually makes it more you know more entertaining that way. 
if you went off of uh, the VR head, the VR chat with the VR, rather than just not. Not that there's a problem with not going without a VR headset. I don't know. I think I'll, I'll, I'll dive into VR once I get my own like place and everything set up. I still think this is a little bit... Hold up. Okay, yeah. Let's go a bit more left. A bit more up. <laughs> Do you know the way to make a megaphone hawk? Uh, I'm pretty sure. It's the, I'm sure. I'm pretty sure. Blade. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> That's about accurate. Oh, Derek Ber uh, Bertrand. Thanks for the sub, buddy. I I guess my sub notifications are working again. I never understand my uh, sub uh, settings. For some reason, the subscription, or not the subscription, the notification does weird things. So let's say that actually is looking pretty solid. I might have to go in and custom paint this in all honesty. That's the, that's gonna be the trickiest thing is I'm gonna have to go and paint it. Rather than just simply do a texture. Although the body, like this particular area, is gonna be able to be textured. Or not really textured, it'll have to be hand painted with like a texture and a bump mat. But going further in, about right here, that could probably just be straight up textured. So let's see here. I think we'll be okay if I actually just extrude this out a bit more. I need to see the side shot. Let's see. Quick, get the pudding. <laughs> Did we get it? Did we get the pudding? Did someone get the? Did someone get it? I hope someone got it. Otherwise, we're gonna have a problem. Maybe. Okay, I think I see what I need to do here. So this just needs to ju uh, shoot out. So actually, what I should have done is actually undo this face here. That is fucking HDD. I'm sorry, Matt. <laughs> Matthew, jeez. Kind of lost the vote, though, man. So yeah, I need to kind of go back now and fix this, because that's kind of something I probably should have done. Well, actually, no, that's kind of got a bump, so actually, this should be fine. I might just do this to kind of give it a bit of a bump set here. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Guess who's back? It's Georgie. Oh, well, hmm, I think that narrowed that down. Mikey, you know what? Any of my mods, you guys know what to do. Let's see, that looks about right. I want to see how this looks. <laughs> you just had to go and do that, man. And it's not that they have... I don't know how many models there are. It could be just... Um, what is it? What am I trying to say here? It could be just that they're... Some of them are reskins, though. But it's fine. Reskins are always fine, because it always does... You know, it's... You don't have to make a, a, a new model for everything. Which is actually fine by me, in all honesty. Now, if you do something like, uh... I think what Destiny 2 did, where almost everything's a reskin, uh, then there's a problem. Alright, so let's see here. This is kind of where knowing your uh, sh shortcuts are going to be useful. Let's see here. I feel, I feel like it's three if I'm not sure. Like I said, man, it's, al it's always fine to have uh, reskins. That's been there's really nothing wrong with it, in all honesty. All right, let's see here. Is this, see, this is, something, this is something funny. I'll show you guys this real quick. So without control loops, this thing literally goes into almost like a ball shape. 
Actually, that kind of looks like a chestnut. Or just maybe even an apple. Just very rough around the edges. Actually, no. Probably more of an acorn body. Except that this were flat. <laughs> Meanwhile, Shovel of Walnuts is like, Yes! <laughs> I noticed the lack of uni. I am disappointed. Uni, you are always disappointed. There is no need to be disappointed. Alright, so let's go ahead and slide this guy back in now. Not really sure how much this is supposed to be. There is one thing I am noticing though, and it looks like it's happening towards the bottom there of the mi of the megaphone. I almost said microphone. So I need to extend this a bit more, I think. Hang on. It's almost about the same size as this microphone, or this body. Alright, I gotta I gotta do a quick scaling. Just to kinda make sure they match up correctly. Whoops. Why? Is there any winter anime worth watching? I need to see what's on the roster. There is one show I at least know I need to watch, and because I've been following it ever since really it came out, and that's uh... oh my goodness, uh, High School Dixie. I know that's gonna be something the, I need to definitely catch up on. I don't really think I need to catch Actually, I don't need to catch up on it. I already caught it, but I just need to wait for it to go. I'm sure some people have some suggestions already. So let's say, go see what, they, what they're saying. Okay, here. I'm actually gonna scale this just a tad bit down. Wait, winter enemy. <laughs> Look, yeah. Alright, let's see if I can get this. Actually, it's about here. Let's say about there. What do you guys. That looks about right. And then there's one extension. Actually, you know what? I can just do this. Get this relatively close, and... Yes. That seems about pretty... Uh, that seems pretty close. It's gonna be one of those things I'm gonna have to like, kind of gauge at the last second. I do need to get this now. The one thing I need to figure out how to do is get that that shark. Like, there's like a shark bit, like the shark fin bit, on the megaphone. That I gotta figure out how exactly to model that. I'm not really used to sh doing shark fin like uh, objects. I could probably figure something out. Oh, hey, Denio. There's a glitchy in the system. Good one. Good one. <laughs> Good one. I don't know. Alright, you know what? I think... Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Wow. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me, I speak in memes here. Okay, how we looking? I think that's about as good as I'm gonna get that. Just a tad bit lower, maybe. <laughs> I just now realized why you, uh, you always have Momoji. <laughs> what do you mean? You never noticed the Dante Momoji? Can never forget best Awu. You're always having that to let us tell if the stream is still going or something to that extent. Something's always moving. Very true! I'm su I'm actually I'm kind of surprised you didn't consider that, man. <laughs> Let's see how this is kind of looking now. All right, so I need to tighten up there. All right. Tighten up right there. Bad touch, stranger danger. All right, let me get the let me get some of the minor touches on here before I really advance from here on out. There's still a few things I want to do. So right here. All right. So there is it looks like a little bit of a bulb sticking out about right here. Is this crooked? Are you crooked? Oh, right, because you exist. All right, so I need to grab this real quick. Did I accidentally? Yep. <laughs> I figured I did. So what I need to do now is I need to make this about right here and then go off of this guy instead. Let's move him. Streaming, dude. Sticky, please. Alright, so this is about right here. So, the one thing I need to do real quick is about right. Let's see here. Where's the side shot? It should be about right there. Yeah. Hey, Daniel Muggins. It's called the flashlight. Sam, please. All right. So what I need to do now? I need to extrude. I need to slightly scale. It. Actually, no. I need to do this first. Extrude out. Like that. I scale this out. Yeah, there we go. So what happens if I put this in this mode? Okay. Whoops. Alright, how's that look? Hey. Okay, I need to fix this right here.
Alright, cool. There we go. Still a little too close, huh? Yeah, one minor problem I'm running into is this right now. Looks flush, is it though? Yes, it is. But I need to control this side here, these edges on this corner. So that means I need to run a, run two edge loops here as well, and that'll pres that should preserve the corners there. And that's probably what I'm looking for, save for one last bit. See, that's just one that's just one of the small things I'm seeing on the uh, actual system there hmm so I wonder let's try this. What I need to do now is I kind of want to extrude this out a bit more. Should be fine. Alright, I think that's good there on that run. Me <laughs> and Dragoon are experts in shanking people. Oh, hey, Cookie. Oh, shoot, no. This escape scale. There we go. That's actually kind of look, starting to look the way I want it to look, actually. I think I still need to fix this bit over here. I do. Alright, right, nice and close. <laughs> Nani! <laughs> How's that looking now? A bit more pronounced, that's exactly what I'm looking for. Yeah. So there we go. That's a good start right now, actually. All right. Let's see. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Oh, apparently I need to sign in to chat. Excuse me? What? <laughs> what? I need to sign in to chat? What is this? <laughs> I... I am confused? <laughs> I'm already very confused. What version of Blender am I using? I'm using 2.78. I probably should update one of these days. I haven't been considering updating in a while. Not sure why I haven't really done anything like that. Alright, let's see here. All of your stream belong to us. Oh god. Ooh, that's a different thing. Oh, interesting. That's weird. Alright, guy has a cookie. I don't have a cookie, but the, but Cookie the Nerd make, makes cookies, I think. I think I recall her saying she makes cookies. Alright, so how am I gonna do this? Plot twist, your hawk is George Head and all his alts. <laughs> if I had the ability to do that. Hey, Archid. I don't remember what your old name was, but you've been around here before. I do make cookie. 
Well, there we go. There's our source of cookies, everyone. I'm kidding. Don't, don't, don't make her do it. Unless she wants to, but seriously. Alright, so I need another cylinder here, I think. So I'm doing this all in edit mode, so when I go into, you know, when I go to move in object mode, it's all one piece. This isn't something that has animatable parts, as much as something like a gun. If a gun had animatable parts, then you'd need it to be separate. Since this is all just one gigantic static model, I don't have to worry about any moving parts or anything. So while I am still modeling this in parts, as you guys can see with the three parts I've got going here, I don't have to worry about it as much because it's all static and not moving. I laced them with I laced them with rat poison. Cookie, how do you stay alive if you lace them with rat poison? I am severely concerned about your health. Alright, I think what I'm gonna try to do is this shark antenna that's about right here on this line. So I need to do that first. I think what I need to do though for this is I need a cube to work with. The biggest problem is try is still trying to figure out how what shape will satisfy this. I think that's my biggest problem right now. And it doesn't look like it's that large. Let me see here. Wait, yeah, you guys kind of see that? <laughs> they are my minions. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Alright, so I need to kind of set this up first. There's a good angle on that. Here it is. Hmm. I think for, <laughs> for some reason I think you're telling the truth. Oh man, that's terrifying to think about then. After this you should model some panzu. Really? You want me to do that? <laughs> Uni, why? <laughs> Uni, please. No. I don't have the pictures. <laughs> you guys are goofy. It's about right here, honestly. That's about right. <laughs> it doesn't work like that, guys. That's not how. That's not how I do things here. It's about right here. It's not that large. Oh, you know what? Actually, hang on, where's the back? I need a back photo here. There it is. So it only goes about midway up through this. What am I looking at? There we are. It's about midway, so about right there. Now this one is actually going to go inward and down. Actually, it just might be easier if I just did this. Let's see how this looks. Yep, that looks about accurate. Sam, nothing, nothing ever done quickly is done well. I'll tell you that. You gotta take your time on these things, man. Just like, just like a lot of my other projects, I have to take, I really take my time on them. It's kind of important I do that, actually. Go here. Hawk, what do, you, what do you think about Vocaloid? I like them. I'm not bi I'm not huge into them. I do really like to listen to them every now and then. Um, Lamaz P is one of my favorite artists behind that. Mitchy M is another one that I really like. And uh, oh, what's his name? Voca Circus. I think his name is Voca Circus. Voca Circus, I think, is the other one, and he does a really good job too. If you haven't heard of these names, I 
seriously suggest go check uh, go checking them out. They they're fantastic. I haven't really gotten to chat with any of them. Not like I'm I can do that. But it is always nice being able to kind of get to know people like that. Miko Expo is back in the U.S. Oh boy, what about a Sonic game? Lose. <laughs> Lugia, why? But yeah, you're bad. Viva, viva, happy. Yep, that's a good one. Axel, that's a fantastic one. Oh, nope, 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 nope. I'll do that. Viva, viva, happy is definitely one of my favorites for that. So there we go. Is this flat at the back, or is it... It is flat at the back. And it's also... Ooh, it's angled too. Okay. Interesting. So I need to grab all these. There we go. You should model a scale to... Sca scape? You mean scale to scale, I think. Of, uh... Uni. I might... Although, I, there, there's two other characters I'm pretty sure I would do first in terms of, like, modeling and or making an organic model of them. And I'm pretty sure most of you already probably know who those two are. If you don't know, that's alright. You just has you probably just haven't been around this channel much. And that's alright. I don't want this being flat. I need to definitely fix that. Hey, Luger, what's up? Organic modeling. Uh, hey, Zachram. Can I ask you a question? Oh, yes, you can, Daniel. What's up? It's a bit more smoothened out here, actually. I think what I might actually do... We got a fat in the chat. <laughs> Cookie, please. It's just Cookie, everyone. Cookie's being Cookie. I'm so surprised that Vocaloid is still a thing. I thought it died out. <laughs> oh god, Sam. Whoops, actually. Oh, not that button. This button. That's the button I wanted. Seizure warning. <laughs> okay, it won't start on. Cookie, you're fundoshi. Uh, fujoshi. Yeah. I think you are a little bit on the confused side there. <laughs> there, and... Goal robot. So what's your goal this year? <laughs> Oh boy, an end joke. Was not expecting an end joke. You thought about undead modeling? I did a little bit of that a while back ago. I wasn't really good at it. Why are you not? Oh, there we go. Did you not grab? Didn't. Okay. You're supposed to grab. Okay, I see what's going on here. Can you unblock your grandma because I'm friends with them and they said to please that they were hacked? I'm begging you. Uh, 
I don't generally reverse bands. It's kind of, if, if it's one of those things, like, if they did it, you know, it's kind of on them. What's going on here? I need to fix this. I'm not really sure why that's doing that, actually. But yeah, I'm not really one to undo bands that quickly, man. You want yaoi jokes, you want them. Not really, Cookie. I fear I might, have, I might have slightly activated a cookie. I don't recognize whatever song this is. Whoops. I'm gonna do this instead then. There we go. Hey Huck, got any advice or tips for modeling? I did only did some a while back, but I never really did much, and I might try it again when you when I have more time. Hmm. Um, I'd say for if you're a beginner, I'd say one of the biggest things that you should really practice on is honestly 2D. So sketch. Um, one of the biggest and probably most important things about 3D art, and particularly with modeling is you need to generally have a pretty strong uh, 2D skill. So being able to sketch out everything. So, like if I had the time normally to go about um, the way that I usually do models like this, I would actually sketch every piece, or just I would do multiple sketches and multiple angles of this uh, megaphone just to kind of see, you know, kind of look at it and see, you know, how it's built and it gives me ideas to how to go about building it, how to optimize things when I need to. That's probably the biggest thing I'd say is focus on a 2D, focus on sketching a lot more and trying to be uh, very, very, very precise. You don't need to be like a perf perfectionist level. It doesn't hurt, obviously, but uh, you know, one of the, I'd say I definitely would stress out that 2D is the biggest thing. You know, for someone who was begging, you're kind of already messing it up, man. That looks pretty accurate there, actually. So, uh, hopefully, that answers what you're looking. For. That's the answer you're looking for there, Zass. God, this is nostalgia at its finest. Quite the nostalgia trip, I'll tell you that. Let's see if I can do this right. Uh, scale, I think it's scale Y. No, that doesn't work that way. Scale is the X. No. Oh no, that's only verts. That's a vert only operation. I think this is the Rebirth 1 menu, isn't it? <laughs> I see it's about time to go to my actual account. Might be necessary. Hey, Crystal! Uh, or hey, Eve, I should say, not Crystal. Unless you have- unless you prefer that one, it doesn't really matter. I'll go by birds here. But there- like, there's a lot of- I need to definitely get back into doing my Blunder uh, vids. Since I did get some feedback that a lot of people really liked what I, uh, really liked them and they were helpful. And if that's the case, I definitely should look into that a bit more. So if it's helpful like that, I'm definitely willing to uh, make more of those. I think that's right. Yeah, it is. I actually need to grab these guys here.
Sorry if I'm being quiet. Usually when I'm being quiet, I'm usually very I'm trying to concentrate as much as I can. This is kind of a big piece to work on, so I'm trying to make it look as uh, good as I can. see here. That was pretty accurate. I can't really, let's see. It's like I, I don't generally like to have to do this kind of stuff in the chat. It's a, it, it's one of those things that kind of, it you know, it's taken time away from me working on this just to kind of take care of something I don't really want to take care of. So... But he leaves me no choice, so I had to take care of it. No, no, come on, Blunder. Blunder, please. There we go. There we go. That looks pretty close. It is a little annoying. I don't like having to do it either. But, you know, I have to eventually. And when I have to, it's just... It doesn't make anything fun for people. Oh, good. This is actually looking pretty nice. I'm liking where it's getting. But yeah, the nice thing is now that I've got, since I'm doing it all in, in one mode and keeping it all as one object, I'm going to name this. I should probably name this before I forget. But it's nice having, uh, like, being able to, you know, fully operate on the thing. And it's easy to rig, too, because it's literally already rigged for you. So, what music is this? What music is this? Uh, yes, this is from the original. White Time is what it's called. Courtesy of Crimson Heart. This is Planet Neptune Rising. Probably should have like some. I I need to get some kind of means of being able to show what uh, music is playing. Everyone, tell my uh, Hawk is mic is muted. I don't think I've muted it. Because I was just answering Zass's question a few seconds ago. I do have it covered. I do have my OBS covered, but I'm pretty sure I'm not muted. I'd find out in a second anyway. <laughs> Alright, so the next thing I need to get is the area in front of the handle, or above the handle. We're actually, I'm actually flying through this a lot faster than I thought I would. The interesting thing is going to be trying to uh, texture this, honestly. I'll have to do these textures separately. <laughs> I've been caught. Runs. So the back of her megaphone looks like a cylinder. Except the bottom part where her hand is, like the grip, or uh, the handle and the grip where she holds it, is actually a f like the flat part of the cylinder. Fan art hawk, can we send you fan? Uh, sure, if you want. Unless, I mean, <laughs> I don't really know what kind of fan art I should be expecting here, especially from the resident Fujoshi. Looks like a flashlight with, with a cray light. How? Uh, 
Twitter works. I have a Discord. There's there's two avenues. I uh, gotta go. I might I might come back if I don't. Goodbye, hot. All right, no problem, Matthew. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. Uh, link should be in the description now, unless YouTube did a dumb and deleted it again. It is... No, oh, no, it's in the description below. So go check that out. If you're not on it, it's fine. It's only... <laughs> it's only been a little more than 10 days and we're already getting some fresh quality memes. Are we now? Alright, let's see here. So how am I going to do this bit? Rotate X about the 90 degree angle. Hmm. Not exactly sure how to go about this. I need to see this from multiple angles. Okay, that actually... Okay, so the end goes straight out. But this is not. Especially with a certain tribe. That's a lot of messages from Sam. Fortunately, I think that also means YouTube's gonna say, Hey, stop it. Get some help. Not that he needs help or anything. I shouldn't do that yet. So this is actually a scale up. This is scale up down right here actually I should do the flattening first hey it's marine I guess Taylor I'm trying to remember Taylor Brandt I don't remember Clearly you've got my old name. I just don't remember who you were. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Today's stream is brought to you by Plan uh, Neptunian Pudding Incorporated. Bite into a delicious sugarness. Of a uh, yeah. Bite into a delicious sugarness of a pudding pack today while the guy trying to read the advertisement has a stroke. Scale Z. Is this what it would work? Yes, that's how you do it. Who the fuck is Hot Zero? I don't know. See, the funny thing is you, you, you said my name, which is why I was like, you know me, apparently. There we go, that's the straight. Actually, that's pretty perfect. I was told to join. Oh, okay. Those, there's some quality loose. <laughs> why? <laughs> why, though? Right, there we go. Skill Z. Yeah, uh, Taylor, you accidentally said my, uh, old name. I need to fix this. Skill Z. That's why I got confused. Don't forget Mars, Chan. Don't forget. How could we ever forget? I think. There we go. That's what I need. God, don't worry about it, Taylor. Rebirth 34, or Art Rule for, oh wait, Rebirth 34. Where did I get Rebirth 34? Rule 34 exists for a reason. Everything will be looted. Yes. That is a very true statement, unfortunate. Haven't you ever dreamed of looting an entire planet? No. <laughs> Who does that? <laughs> If I recall correct correctly, Marine Hawk 2012 is your YouTube. It is. Really. I thought I changed it. I guess you. Well, okay. I could say everything I want, but it's, at the end of the day, YouTube's always gonna somehow mess things up. 
I just got very confused because I was like, how does this person know my old name? I need to get rid of this face. I think this is now the time where I can get rid of the face. Let's see here. This is kind of a spooky, slightly spooky. There we go. Do you love me some rule 34? Of course you do. There we are. Right here seems fine. Click this. That seems pretty close, actually. I'm leaving if Logan's not here. Uh, don't worry about it, Taylor. Thanks for stopping by at the very minimum. It's always nice to see a new face around. Let's see here. How's that looking? Ah, that's not the mode. That's not the mode I want. And then we're going to scale it in. Out there, I think. In. Alright, Sam, come on now. Is that necessary, man? To be honest, we do need more console loots. You already have enough console loots. It's the Neptunia girls. <laughs> I think that's right. That looks right. That seems... It seemed adequate. Not what I want. Undo that. This theme, this theme sounds so silly. This gives me the impression that I'm on a pirate ship for some reason. Seems correctly. He's someone that's cool, but quality one though. <laughs> For all. Alrighty then. So I'm not really sure where this handle is supposed to be now that I look at it. Where is this handle connecting to? Oh, there's a. Oh, okay. So it's not actually connecting there. There's a bit right here. Wait, is this flat? Did I miss something here? I don't think I did. Yeah, I think we're fine. Gonna get a winter storm tonight. Yeah, my uh, news forecast said the same thing. Hope it's not too bad. Oh, and this is where I say George had, by the way. Alrighty then. It's actually looking relatively close to it. 
Really, the big thing it's going to come down to is the texture later on. Alright, so I think this is similar to- this is another square. Mississippi usually never gets snow. This is going to be a miracle. Oh, it is? It's supposed to be plus 15 tomorrow where I live. Wow, that's nice temps. Very nice temperatures, man. I don't know what it's supposed to be for us, although... Oh, I'm just hoping it's not too bad. So I think a cube will work here as well. I'm glad our snow finally went away. See, it's like, I, my parents hate, absolutely, like, do not like snow. I don't mind it. I actually personally like having snow. Then again, when I uh, used to play sports in high school, <laughs> some of our practices would turn into a, uh, Surprise snowball fight, which was fantastic. Actually, this is going right there. Yeah. Uh, Z? No. Why? Oh, I did the same thing. Whoops. Scale Y. Twenty plus where I'm at. 2017 is way too cold. Okay, whatever you say. Oh, hey, Shad. How's Shad doing today? Alright, let's see if I get this. Whoops. It's like right here, I think. This is this back bit, bit is roughly uh, straight because the handle's going here. There's definitely one thing I need to work with here. I'm doing good except they ate too much on my birthday. Oh, is today your birthday? It is. Well, happy birthday. Hope it was fun. Obviously, aside from the I ate too much cake bit, but <laughs> I'm sure that's fine. Not was yesterday. I see. Well, happy belated birthday then. At the bare minimum. Let's see. Mine is the 26th. Oh, wow. That's coming up. 26th is coming up. Oh, boy. Alright, so let's see, that actually looks roughly like all I need. Although I think this needs to be brought in a little bit. I got a while before mine hits. I can't believe I'll be <laughs> getting there. Won't be much longer, but it, it will come eventually. Let's see here. Whoops. Right there. Oh well, you yeah, that's that's definitely a while from now. Not me, I'm Halloween. Oh wow, that's an interesting birthday. Wonder how that That's very interesting. Can't really tell, is that smaller? It's 
It's almost kind of right here. Kind of looks like it's arced a bit, or not arced. No, curved. That's what I'm looking for. Almost like this. Kind of like a that, that kind of look. That looks right. Is that starting to look like it, guys? There's a camera, even though... Oh, no, the camera's still here. It's just hidden. Let's see. Yes. Um, see this. Cursor center. View. Line view. Center cursor. Looks pretty close. It won't look as much like it until I get the things textured a bit more. It will take some time though. I'd hate to be born. I'd hate to have people born on the 30th of February. <laughs> I don't even think the 30th even happens. Oh, it's a birthday for three years. Wait, are you gonna have it? I don't remember there being on the 30th. Maybe there was the 20th and 29th. Wow. It's weird hearing this version of it and remembering how it sounded like in Rebirth 1. Oh, something happened here. Oh, Taylor Brandt. Okay. I'd rather not have to deal with too much, or have my mods deal with too much of this. Alright, so really we're done with it. We're already down to the... Really? Already down just to the grip. The grip is weird looking. Hawk said Nip needs pudding. I don't have any pudding. I really don't. Wait, why were his message deleted? He was timed out. <sighs> what shape is this, though? I guess I could make it like a square, but that's like a. It's a weird shaped cylinder though. No, why? I just don't have any. Uh, I don't think it was banned. I, just think, I don't think banning is a thing in, the, in this uh, universe anymore. I can't seem to do. Uh, there's no way to ban really anymore. Oh wow, I have access to slow mode. That's funny. Oh my gosh, glitchy Lugia. Wow. You too. Chill. I'm kidding. Uh, see, the weird thing is I'm not really sure what the handle should look like. It's weird. I'm trying to think of this. I want to say a cylinder, but so I'll try a cylinder. I am in object mode. I shouldn't be. Oh, I made a mistake. Uh oh. I, I knew I knew I knew I was I knew I was doing something wrong here. Okay, copy this. Object mode. Click this. Edit mode. Paste. No. Words. Paste. 
least. What did that do? Confused. Lugia is supposed to be active. This isn't the Lugia I know. I'm just not used to it. That's all it is. You're just not used to it. So I made a mistake here, and this is not supposed to be part of the original. This is not supposed to be a separate shape. So I need to get rid of this, but I'm going to hold on to it for now just so I can kind of model it. So I need to redo that. Whoops. I was gonna make I knew I was gonna make a mistake eventually, I just didn't know when. Cursor to center, selection of Kurt. What? Aces. It's just gone. I don't even know where that went. Let's see. Um Always here for the chill build streams. I could say they're definitely chill. I like them this way too. It's a lot more. I mean, it's not probably the most interesting thing to watch. I don't know. I'm I'm not you guys. I can't exactly figure out what's entertaining for you guys to watch. This is just something I like to do. It does kind of give you guys a little idea as to how models are made, though, which is probably something I think some of you probably enjoy. Oh, there it is, probably getting in the creative mood. I'm not sure. <laughs> we must find a queen. We're back to the Ugandan memes, oh boy. Outside likes watching creative content like this. Well, that definitely does make sense. That's why I'm sitting there. I was like, yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of people that would like this stuff, which makes sense. I'm just gonna slightly modify this. I mean, I just, I just like modeling. Ever since I got into it from my early years in college, it was definitely something that I enjoyed. And you know, that's kind of something I, you know, can't help but be happy about. Don't know what I'd be doing if I never learned modeling. Hulk doing it away. Hulk must have a bullet in it away. Oh, I'm gonna start a new meme. Do you know the way of the nap? <laughs> Do you know the way of the nap? <laughs> Do you know the way of the pudding? I made a silly meme on my, uh... One of my, uh, videos I recorded, I made a really s silly meme. At least I think I did. I don't know. No, I know anyway. That begs the question, which Nep gir Neptunia girl would be the perfect queen of the Ugandan knuckles? Don't know. 
Accidentally a boss fight. Nope, it was uh, Sunrider, actually. Sunrider is where I made the silly meme. Like, I actually went and made one, not like I y took one and kind of tweaked it. Is that... Okay, I need to... We're going in. P shot ready to the queen. <coughs> oh, so she'd be P she would or Plusia. I don't think that's an alt. That's definitely not an alt, man. All right, so I gotta try this handle. This handle's gonna be weird to do. Sam, that's not an alt, man. Goes in like this. So if I went in with this uber small, whoops. Do something like this, maybe. See, sizing this is going to be weird. Last name was Bran on the other one, though. Was it? There's no way I could have told. I could tell, though. Oh, yeah, B-R-A-N-T. Yeah, that is it. That is an all. I don't really know how else to go about doing it than this. This is basically making a spear, except modifying it slightly. Hmm. So how big is this thing compared to the... do real quick I need to go and I'm gonna keep this into scale so I'm gonna use is the megaphone this half right here to kind of help me keep track of the scaling the handle is about two of this. A little less. I'd probably say more around probably like 180% of this thing. Oops. So I'd probably say stop about, right? About right there, probably. A lot of this is just going to be me trying to figure out how to set this up.
That's my biggest problem right now, is figuring this out. Actually, you know what? This would be something I think I could probably, I probably should have done. Nah, there's no way I could do this with Mirror. There's no way I could have done this because it would have been really weird doing it with Mirror. I'm going to leave this as is. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to bring this back to where it was. I think what I need to do is this needs to go out more. Yeah, this is going to take a little bit of trying to figure out how I want to tweak this. Her hand seems to be roughly right about where the edge of this is. Oh, this thing's slightly curved, too. Oh, my goodness. That would explain that a little bit. It's a little bit like this. So that would mean that, yeah, down here is where this curve reached its peak. Sorry if I'm talking to myself. Yeah, I'd say it's fine. Noticing something, I I think I might have done a little bit on the wrong side here, and it's mainly this cone right here. Cause this is I think ad accurate. This is I don't think I don't think it is. So I might make a, a, smi a slight tweak to that in a bit. Come on. There we are. Um, chickens. I think this handle, for the most part, is accurate. I might have to shrink it a little bit, but I think for the most part, it is where it needs to be.
biggest problem I'm going to have here is if I get off, if I'm a little bit off on the arc, it's going to do something weird. Oops. So it is a little off. That's fine. Oh, there's my chat. What, what the heck? If you're wondering where all the oracle oracles are, I captured them. Oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Did I not get this one? No, I did. Oh, okay, no, I don't want that. here, I think. Yep. Seems about where it needs to be. Alright, so now this is the one thing I need to change. What I'm just doing is slowly incrementing this a little bit. Not too much. Is there going to be a fall of the poor stream tomorrow? There should be. Unless something happens, which I don't think anything is bound to happen. So that is something to look forward to. Notice me already said bye. Hi, Zed. <laughs> right. Stop you violating the law. This way, I think. Senpai. Senpai, huh? <laughs> Stop reminding me I had Japanese class today, guys. <laughs> I think that's
it's actually pretty close. So where this is... This needs to be more arced. I wonder how many swears Hawk knows in Japanese. <laughs> not that many, if it will... To, just, just to shock you here, not that many. Which means this is now off. He hasn't updated that in a while. He's slacking. What about it? What were we talking about? I'm slacking for. Where did the day hog? Do you remember? Oh yeah, I've been meaning to get back into that. I need to definitely add more to that. I'm kind of messing that up lately. Thanks for that reminder. I guess. <laughs> Yeah, I do need to definitely update that. I've been... I was busy earlier this, uh, the start of this semester. Since, um... I'm one of the few guys in my, in my, uh... In my two departments that I am, you know, studying in. Who's doing both of them. And so they were, they were, uh, wanting me to kind of sit in on a few meetings to try to devise a, uh... Help them kind of come up with a, uh, a curriculum for the major that I just did. Mostly since they see it as a beneficial kind of thing. I will get to that though, don't worry. But yes, I do remember word of the day and I've been slacking on it. I apologize. I've also I haven't been able to really touch the grammar lessons either. Jesus. Ugh. Suddenly I'm a little upset at myself. That's more like it. <laughs> Do I know the way? I know. How many times are we going to ask if I know the way? Of course I know the way. Why wouldn't I know the way? <laughs> yes, the way of the Neps. <laughs> of course. I should be actually grabbing these bottom ones here. Now I think about that. Whoops, these. Let's see here. So I'm just doing a lot of individual tweaks real quick. Whoa! Hugsies are also me and dude both want models of all the Neptune you care. That's gonna be a lot of them. Um, my goodness. Kyo wa mokyobi, yes. Hi. 
そうです。今日は木曜日ですよ。Case anyone's not sure what we just said, 木曜日 is Japanese for Thursday. My world? Ah, I see what's going on there. A little, little nip and, a, and the pick in the Discord. Oh, okay. Thursday? Thursday! <laughs> oh, Cookie. Why does nobody have a long a lasting love relationship? Ships sink. I、uh, guess you're not wrong. There are always the few that will defy everything, you know. Those are the interesting ones. Well, technically, you could say that about every single ship in the anime universe. Thanks, Omnio. Omnio Mega OB is Japanese lesson videos for my Japanese skills. My ships are floating. Are they now? Let's see here. Kind of thing. No, it's not even a scale. Ah, shoot. Alright, how's this looking now? Might be a little too. Yeah, it's a little too much. <laughs> My ships are floating. No, okay, plus J. What? What is with this Apache helicopter? Should I be concerned? I heard the sounds of an Apache helicopter. Should I be expecting bullets? Should I have the concern? Terribly wrong. Don't know how I didn't grab both of you, but okay.
Looks good, getting there. Almost there. I think. I think I, it feels a lot better, or it looks a lot better once I made those tweaks. I'll have to see how the final actually looks like, but I do like what I did with the tweaks, so I think that was definitely the big thing I needed. Did this, whatever this, whatever happened here. pretty reasonable and that just and this is supposed to extend just barely past this it means I need to rotate it a bit more yeah that's at a 90 degree this needs to be at a little less than that tell you about the X it's almost like it looks like this A little more. Let's see. You have a hundred or no a thousand five hundred and fifty cherry blossoms. That is a lot. That is a lot, good sir. Do you have, do you have plans to spend it on something? That actually seems pretty much about where I wanted it to be. Okay, so what I need to do now is I want to adjust this to its pivot point. I gotta figure out where that pivot point would be. Probably on the handle. Like right here in the dead center. So, three. Ah! Camera, please. I think Nepgear has the most, if I remember correctly. So one thing that's important to notice is, or one thing that's important to make out here, is any rotation and scale operations. So the if you're a Blender user, the R key or the S key are done in, rel in relative position of this little orange dot here. This is considered its center of mass. Um, this is the reason why if I were to rotate it, it rotates about this orange dot. What I want it to do is rotate about right here. So to correct that, I just go into object mode or, or edit mode and place it about where it should be. I might have to tweak it a little bit. So this is basically the object's center of mass. So now, when I rotate it, it's going about that handle instead of the main, the main, the body of the actual object. <laughs> Spin to win. Oh, I broke it. There we go. Nope, I broke it again. Wait, 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 wait. Which way? Aha. Uh, Hang on, I got this. I got this. I 
to present to you guys a meme to entertain you all for about 20 seconds. All right, I'm done. <laughs> All right. All right, now that we had our little laugh there, we had a little bit of a laugh. <laughs> All right, now I got to get to UVing this thing. Uh, that was funny. <laughs> This will be where the fun. This will be where the real fun's gonna start hitting in. Oh boy, freeze! Copyright police. Don't worry, I only played less than twenty seconds, so it doesn't count. It shouldn't. If it does, then oh god. I don't think they're gonna care too much anyway. I don't get it. Look look up the uh, get down meme, uh, dude it's life. That's a very old meme. Well it's older than it usual. Uh let me tell you about the why. too concerned about I mean I don't like copyright claims on videos but I'm not that concerned about it cuz I don't monetize <laughs> sorry I can someone type what he said I never got what he said I don't read it here get done I think that's what that is I believe it's I believe that's how you spell it oh I'm sorry no 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 it's not that it's not that It's this. I always I always do uh, T's for some reason. T the T uh, uh, T A and D A are basically the same character, just with two little accent marks above it. All right, how am I gonna UV each individual piece of this? Let's see. Well, the torus will be the easiest bit. That's just taking this line going across here and literally um, marking the seam. That's all I need there. The problem with this is the fact that it's all going to be in one spot. Every bit of this is going to be um, in one UV, which can be a bit of a pain. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this then. I'm gonna do yes. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and start using materials. I should be doing this. And now everything's gonna bind to that because it has to. Okay. 
So I'm just gonna go ahead and start texturing this all. Something I honestly should be doing. You know what, I should just do this. Nope. Okay, I think that's it there. So this new... So this is kind of where, like, you need to have, you need to focus on your, uh, materials so you can make sure you're not messing anything up here. This is more of a dark orange. I'm gonna go closer to that. Grab this. Oh shoot, I just signed that. These are these are the dark colors, if I remember correctly. No, this matches the same color as this inner one. Okay. Hawk, have you ever worked with a vo Vocaloid program or with the MMD before? I've toyed around with MMD before. Can't say I was very good with it. It's the same thing with Source Filmmaker. I haven't really had a means of really learning how to use it yet. Whoops. There we are. But I do, I definitely do want to get to learn them because they are very cool to, they look very, like, like a lot of fun to use. So I need another one here. Uh, this new. I don't really know what to call this antenna. Not really. I don't know. Speaker. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know the. I don't know the, each individual piece of the megaphone here. This is almost exactly like this color, except a bit more on the brighter side. This is the difficulty I have right now. So what I'm doing right now is trying to match these bits up correctly. Vocaloid singing program is difficult. I can get that. I definitely can understand that being a difficult thing. I haven't used it. Uh, at least the synthesizer stuff, I haven't really even tried to use that. So I can't say that I know how to do any of that. Which is kind of why I like People like Lamaz P do like it's incredible what they can do with it. To this day it kinda surprises me, honestly. Looks like this goes about right here. Okay. 
So I'm just giving this a nice little... One of the most important things to also notice here, or note here, if you're using any painting software like uh, I do with Substance Painter, you need to have all these materials set up, otherwise it's going to cause problems. It makes it easy to identify where things are, and also just prevents things from getting, uh, from going wrong. I'll UV this in a bit though, but I'm gonna I'm gonna at least get the coloring done. So you guys can at least see what the basic coloring would look like. Oh my goodness, okay. It's gonna look like that, cause it's still yep, there we go. Cool. Although I don't think that's right. Oh, I see why. One minor mistake I made there. This needs to be this color. Yep, that's what I needed to do. At least I can at least get Miku to say some words. That's good. That does kind of matter. So one thing I'm gonna need to definitely work on here is getting the lines drawn for the black outline that we're supposed to have here. But you guys can kind of see it's coming together now. May not be the exact color we're looking for, but it gives me something to kind of work with. Okay. So from here, I need... I will go ahead and do... I'm going to line up some things just so that way they match correctly. So like right here should be a... Um line that's very similar to the outer edge that I've got going here. So this would be uh, this color. That way when it'll show kind of like that kind of line that it has. Which is good. Cool. Alright, so now I need the base color of this thing. Oh, that just abruptly ended. Alrighty then. Uh, you know what? Here, let's do this then. second. Come on. There we are. There we go. There we go. Alright, so this is going to be like a stock yellow. I need to send you my Miku words. Alright. That's fine. <laughs> um, hi Sam. Alright, so this gets a little weird here. How do I do that? Um, I... Like I always say, I'm on, uh... I'm on Discord, and I'm also... You, I'm also I also have a Twitter. So I definitely, you know, those are two avenues there. It's a good portion of this. 
So I'm just going to make this white. Blue. Oh, hi, Nep Nep. You can tweet at me. Um, if you have a Discord, the link is in the description. Feel free to pop onto that. You are more than welcome to join. Betray me. There we are. So. Yeah, right now it's mostly going to be. Like, once we get to this part, this is mostly going to be white. This will also be mostly white. And that, there's going to be an edge back here. Let me go ahead and add that now, actually. So, there, I'd say. I wanted to make a group called the way of the chair of my giant possums, but no mod said but the mod said no, we must give them pudding. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just doing this to kinda pin uh, not really pinpoint, but kinda give me a general idea as to how the model is supposed to look. That's just white and then leads in. Okay. I'm back at falling asleep while the stream is running. That's fine, Soul. Hopefully you're not falling asleep of boredom, though. I feel bad. I know this isn't exactly the most entertaining of things, so... It would make sense to me. Aren't you just gonna make this a black color? Can I get this? Nope. Yes, got that. And this guy is going to be mostly, I think, that white color. Except for the tip. The tip is that nice, nice orange. What you're talking about? I love your streams all day, every day. I'm glad you do. Let's see here. Come on. All right. So I think what I'm gonna try to do here is I'm gonna do this. This is the, the side. Actually, no, this is probably the better color. That's gonna look blocky for now, but that's okay. Oops. Alright, so there's a black line that leads here, but the rest of it actually is white. Very thin black line. Well, that's probably this. Um, that's probably also white. I just gotta move this for a second. Okay, good. No one freak out. I was just moving it for a second. Okay. I 
Can I hide this individual piece, or is it not going to let me hide it? No, it won't. Okay. Alright. So. I've got this black line i got to work with, so I think this is what I'll do. as well. And now... Uh, that's fine. Actually, no, that's not fine. Shoot. How many pictures of Neptune do you guys have? <laughs> Quite a lot. Probably easily answer for that question for them. <laughs> yep. Not surprised with Lugia there. probably gonna end up bigger than I really want it to be. That, this black color I'm talking about. supposed to be a wine anyway. Whoops. Yeah, that's supposed to be white. This is gonna be hard to get. Let's see if I can grab it. There we go. Alright, how's that looking now? Yeah, that's... I kind of expected that to happen. That's because there's no control loop here stopping that water. Or, water. <laughs> um, white from uh, basically causing uh, that bleach-like effect. Actually, probably would be a good thing to do that. Out here, I'd say. So this is orange here, that's white all the way. So this is where the white begins. What? hundred pictures of Neptune and over and under 200 of the other CPUs that's a lot a general folder of 6740 I think I think glitchy wins I don't even need to read anymore and <laughs> a separate loop folder of course of course you know something I that just dawned on me Let's try this out. I know I'm making the viewport smaller, but I want to test something here if I can get this to work. Give me a second here. I need to grab... I need to grab something real quick. I think I can get this to work. Oh, whoops. Excuse me, guys. I'm testing something. Don't worry. I 
I, mean, I need to see if this works, though. Oh no, everyone saw my name! <laughs> everyone saw my name! Oh. Was it the Mickey Mouse there? What was that? Hey, I'm test- I'm trying to get something to work here. Uh... I guess what was it called? this. I'll see if this works here. Whoa, no! Oh, no! Lock that. Lock this and lock that. I don't think this is working. Alright. Hopefully that works. You guys will know when you start typing. At least I think. I could be terribly wrong. Oh yeah, there's work. I actually have a, a picture of base form Vegito, Super Saiyan Gogeta, and Nenito for my desktop background. With Planetune background. Nenito is the Poltara fusion of. Interesting. <laughs> Nani? <laughs> that's goofy. I think that might be too small. I'm testing something with the chat. I want to keep. I want to. I want to try to put the chat back into this. These kind of streams. And it'd be nice if I did that. That way you guys can see when I see a comment. Or when a comment appears. I think that'd be kind of useful. I'd imagine. Hopefully it's not too small though. I can't really tell. That's very tiny. That is very tiny. That chat box might be a little too tiny, actually. We can all yell at the chat for dying again. Nora has a great... <laughs> I see. I'm gonna try this, then. Yeah, let's see if that works now. <laughs> it's kind of hard to see it because, well, I guess I could chat. I'll, I guess I could chat. I'm not sure. What's going on here? Oh, you're not supposed to be that color. But yes, we can bring back the whole... Man, that chat timer is very short, too. My goodness. How long is the, the hide message after 15? That is not 15 seconds. That is not 15 seconds. How is that 15 seconds? Actually, no, that, that seems actually accurate. Never mind. Alrighty. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm pressing caps lock. I'm not shift. That would explain it. Alright, actually. Going back into here. These are the same color as these guys. I think it's this. No, it's this one. Oh, 
there's an out. <laughs> right. Too many materials. There we go. So what I'm going to do to save myself the time here... I have no experience with the computer. That's not entirely true. What are you watching this on, then? I have to keep my phone at landscape to type. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's that's also very true. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make all of this white, which is not true, which is not accurate at all. But this will help me do this. Be faster to do it this way than do it the other method here. So now, that's gonna look like that anyway. And most of this actually is, um, I think this entire thing. I'm just going to make it white for the sake of it now. And then same thing here. Actually, you know what? I think I might do this. this. Bleach it. So there's the basic form without the like black and white and stuff. Or the, the blue. I could go in and add the blue, but I might just do that as a texture later on. That shouldn't be too difficult for me to do, considering I'm very I'm decent enough with painting to work. Nep nep with the sup up oh, there get going. <laughs> Where is this where's the source? Where's that source? Oh, that's why. Weird. Why is it giving me that level up? Wait, well, how is it giving me the level up then? Interesting. I don't know how that happened. But nep nep, thanks for the sub. <laughs> Alright. So now comes the relatively difficult part. I'm gonna go ahead and close the uh, video for a second. Didn't the subscriber thingy used to be an adult net popping up from the side? It should have been. Oh, I know why. I think I know why. I accidentally overrode it. I'm smart. I made a mistake there. Mistakes were made, guys. I'm not gonna go watch JoJo. All right, see you, Cookie. I made a mistake. Yeah, I, I accidentally overrode the sub alert. Let's do this. Name already is in you. Wait, what? Excuse me? What? 
I don't have that many sources here, though. What? All right, give me one second here. There we go. I'm actually going to move this. This needs to be moved then. And here you go. Here, let's do this. Where is the... I think it's this thing, right? Uh, where is this thing? I'm not used to using this thing as much, which is kind of weird. I'm getting used to it slowly. Which is kind of... <laughs> I don't know. Event list? It used to show. Ah, here we are. There we go. There you go, Nep Nep. You got it. I fixed it. We're good. <laughs> it took me a second to fix it, but I got it. Alright, now, on to the hard part. I think I've already done this this down here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to separate by this. I'm actually going to move this to wireframe for a second just to make sure. So what I have to do here is I need to... Um, Simply just get all of my lines where I need them to be. This will give me the ability to kind of work with the um, UV individually. Slow start looks good. Okay. I don't know what slow start is. I feel bad because I feel like I should, but I don't. Alright, so what I need to do now is I need to figure this guy out here. Figure out how to cut him. It's always difficult finding that. Slow start is a new enemy. Oh, it is. Okay, cool. Yeah, I need to. I need. I definitely need to catch up now. I'm way behind on the whole anime thing. Especially since I used to do. I just used to watch so much of it. And that should be a connected box, and it is. So that should separate that. However, what I need is... Alright, because this is a cylinder. Okay, so this needs to... Actually, no, this will cut off. No, it doesn't wrap. Mark the seam there. And here. Straight down to the bottom of this. should handle that cylinder. Although right now only Crunchyroll Premium members can watch it. Oh, that's a bummer. Just kind of wish everything was good at that, huh? Well, if this must be really good, well, hopefully it's really, it, you know, it stays good. One of the things I've always been upset with with anime is the fact that some of them tend to kind of, they start off with a really good, like, really 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 good um you know they get they, they basically get a really good start and then i for reasons beyond my knowledge they just crash 
And that's really just the sad thing, because you... You know, like... What's this? What show recently did that? There's, pro there's probably thou uh, countless examples I could use here. But it was just... It's just sad seeing that kind of thing happen. Because, like, oh, this show is going to be amazing. It's going to be one of those really cool ones. And then it just, like, dies. I think uh, Me Mechadox City Actors, I think, was one of those. I, I think I might have butchered the name. I don't. I haven't watched, uh, seen that one in a while. I don't think I need to actually tweak that one anymore because I think the yeah the bottom of this thing is missing. These all done, really. All right, this is gonna be the pain. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna treat this as two cylinders. As a cylinder with two ovals on it. So this I'm gonna mark here. So the peaks, these two, the peaks of these two uh, like bulbs, are going to be seams themselves, and then I'm going to choose a line here, cut it all the way across to there. Nope, nope. And mark that seam. All right, if everything is good, I shouldn't have any problems with the UVs now, because this should be pretty set. And it looks like I might actually have one. But I can fix that by doing this. Yes. Mekarak City Actors. That was a that was weird as fuck as I've ever seen the, the material is based on. Started out good for the first few minutes and turned to gr Yeah, basically. Um See what's funny is there's, like, there's those kind of shows, there's the really good ones, and then there's the ones that, like, it takes a little bit of kind of watching it to kind of get how the, the game, how the anime goes. And even though it's a, it's a very slow, it's a very, like, there's some that were so story-driven, it's extremely slow. And that was, I think, what killed um, anime called Red Data Girl. I don't know how many of you know that one. That was one I watched back in uh, 2012, 2013. It, was a, it, it wasn't a bad show. It was just, it started off, it had a very slow um, story progressing. It just seemed like it started so slowly. There are, it's a lot of verts. 3,000 verts, also 3,000 faces. That's actually pretty dang good. Let's see the faces here. 50k for uh, Mega Dimension? Megaphone? Yeah, that's not bad. It's a very high poly, which is fine, I guess. UV. How, oh, how bad did this go? Okay, come on. Come on, Windows. Yeah, so these are what UV these are these are what UVs will look like when they're kinda terrifying to look at. <laughs> This is not the worst I've ever seen of a UV map. And if you guys want to see the worst I've ever seen, let me go find that. I think I still have it on me. Do I? Yes, I do. Here it is. So I'll show you a nightmare UV versus this UV. So this, this UV map is very, very clean, and most of the pieces seem to be separated. That this is a pretty good UV. Where UV maps go wrong are ones like these. You really don't know where anything is in here. Everything is stacked on top of itself. And just trying to find one part of it is a pain in the butt to look at. I'm pretty sure some of you are looking at this like, holy good lord, that thing's ugh. And to be completely honest, I'll let you know. Let me let me show you what model that was. That I was working on. Ooh, this is a good one. Uh, yeah, here it is. So this was what that UV map was. Oh, hey, Kobe. That's kind of how atrocious that was. <laughs> This 
one doesn't know the way. Oh my goodness, dude. <laughs> so I think, for the most part, everything is now prepped. We're ready to go for the most part. The nice thing is with all the UV work and the material work I did, everything should be good to go. However, I'm not going to be able to do all of it because I think some, I want to really build the textures on some of these. So I might come back to this and um, do the texturing, but I'm going to go ahead and take it into Substance Painter so you guys can at least see what that looks like. So we can at least get to, uh, get to a little bit of work on it. So I'm going to go ahead and I should probably have saved this a while back ago. Dude, who's the main megaphone? Oh, came up with their dev update, and here's the comment to sum it up. Nice. By full chance, we'll be out of the beta and back in T1. Nice. <laughs> oh, Kobe. So yeah, this looks like this looks like a nightmare right now. We'll ignore that for the time being. Let me make sure. I gotta make sure it went into the right spot where it normally should go. It did. Oh wait, where where did where did that send to? Oh, I didn't export it right. This is in Blender models. Okay. And okay, there's the OBJ. Good. All right, so. Oh right. That's my favorite four, uh, four goddesses online track. It is a pretty good one. I did like it too. Nope, that's not it. Yes. Cross your fingers. Yes. All right. So I need to find where the uh, this uh, outer ring is right here. So now I get to play with the usual stuff. By the way, I've said this before, but 4GO should should have been a Vert's game. Yeah, I can agree with that. I definitely think it should have been. I'm gonna go ahead and move this uh, chat again, just so you guys can kind of read it. Oh, and I gotta switch to Maya controls now. Let us see here. How am I gonna do this bit? So, okay. Hmm. There's not really anything of that right color here. It's just like a orange here. Wait, no, this. there yeah that's good uh, specularity reflectiveness maybe specular here we are specular is a yellow more like right around here yes that's good uh, I need a emissive. Yeah, I think it's good. Okay. So this is gonna cover the whole thing. Yes, it does. I'm actually just gonna do this. Easier this way.
This is one of the nice things about Substance Painter is the fact that, oh, you got two ways you can apply it. You can do it over here, like this, or you can go directly to the model and do it this way. Extremely useful. splash of white right there. I think we're good though. Let's see if I've got this color right. Where what am I looking at? There we are. Alright, I'm gonna go to I ray real quick. Now I want to see just how well this orange works. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. It's laying on the ground. Not very emissive. Oh, it's because it's not enabled. Um, I need to match this color. That's probably what I was doing wrong. I just forgot to be emissive. Well, I need to go out of this and redo this. Looks like a chess figure. <laughs> I can see that. Yeah, that's better. Except that's too yellow. Which I think that could just could be because of its specularity. Or is that is that the emissive? I'm gonna redo this layer then. All right, I gotta click this and that. Yeah, there it is. That's what I'm looking for. It's, an, it's that kind of it's it's like an obnoxious orange, but it's like the perfect. Uh, that's almost that's almost exactly what I need. I'm actually pretty happy with that. So is this right here? No, that's not it. That does not match that color, though. Yeah, that color really isn't used outside of the handle. off. Let's see how that looks. Pretty solid, actually. I think it's nice how crisp this looks. Like the geometry actually is pretty well done. Cool. I think that's the right color I was looking for too. So that's good to see. Is this what's her face? Black cat. <laughs> I think so. That's just like a standard color. I'm surprised No Game No Life is getting a uh, more time after what happened to its dev or its original producer. This is like a dark, more of a red side. 
uh, specularity is needed here. This is like a red. I'm just gonna adjust this too a little bit. I just wasn't sure. I don't think I'll be able to see that much. Huh, surprise. I can. And yes, that's the right color I'm looking for. This, this, this bit. I like this bit. <laughs> Everyone hates Black Cat Princess. She's a little too egotistical, which is kind of the reason why I didn't like her. Alright. Getting there. Alright. Now I need a yellow. Almost roughly this color. Alright, so where is this? This should be the base yellow if I remember correctly. Yep. Alright, so I need like a... Actually, that's pretty close. I'm just, I'm going based off of what I'm looking at. Umio with legs. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, I can't say I was really fond of her. She kind of almost served like the whole I'm I'm an antagonist for the sake of being an antagonist. Does this throw off that? It does not. Good. Let me see how this looks. Is that the right color? goes around the top. Wait, did I put this in the wrong direction? Yes. Yes, I did. Oh, boy. Okay, so I need to go back to this base yellow here. Is there an E? So I'm going in here and a adding a custom paint myself. This might take some time though. Oops.
Not when I wanted to rotate, but okay. part is getting this exactly what I want it to be. Especially since I'm using a mouse to do all this. Yeah, I'm cutting out that, and then uh, I'm basically kind of trying to flatten out the area that's supposed to be black. It will be, don't worry. I'm just kind of touching it up so that way I can draw over, because this thing works like a layer system. And black doesn't really have a specularity here. So I'll drop the specular here. If I remember correctly, this kind of thins out. So this kind of goes right over here. Why are you not as strong of a stroker as I was expecting you to be? Yeah, this is where the hand paint's gonna have to come in. Let's play Can I Do This. I don't think it goes all the way around too, which is nice. Yeah, I can only paint this so well, unfortunately. So my paint job's probably a little. <laughs> really good tablet that I could use, so. I'd really have fun if I could, if I could just paint with the tablet. It is a little red. The eggplant is a little red. Although it's more like a- it's more- it's less purpley than usual. At least when I look at it compared to the Discord variant.
Okay, that looks accurate enough. Alright, all I gotta do now is just kind of set this in right here. When it comes to making like, a nice restaurant or anything else from scratch, you gave yourself a good challenge. I needed to get back into uh, Blender. It's been a while. Glad you appreciate it, though, man. I can go back to here real quick. Honestly, this is like this is one of the things I love doing, though. It's fun to make. It is a blast to just sit here and spend all the time just working on it. <laughs> Alright, so now I need to get the rest of this. So what I need to do is put this new layer underneath it. And then anywhere where this is going to pop up is going to be white, I think. If you excuse me, I have this bomb off to throw it with a net bike. I think that's actually fine. If I have to tweak this, I'll tweak it. This is why I love being able to do this. <laughs> Instead of having to try to find the right angle to get in there and paint it, I can just paint it right here. And it updates that for me. Most of this should be white, I think. It's... I guess it's time to splatoon the rest of this. Top part looks like a kettle. <laughs> it does kind of look like a kettle. A UV texture would make this so much easier. Since I'd be able to pretty much have everything uh, set up and I could make sure everything is symmetrical. But let's see if I can do, let's see what I can do with hand painting. Or mouse painting, I guess, if you want to put it that way. It's funny when you when I like accidentally grab the screen instead of actually start painting because I just start shaking the screen like I know what I'm doing. <laughs> like that right there. Oh, I see some still. Right here. Right now I need to go 
back into this one. This over here. Might just do this underneath. This thing is going to be so flipped around by the time I'm done with it. There we go. Which I would probably spend more time focusing on this than I will the other half. Let's see. Alright, so now I need to go back to the white. And now I need to do this bit. Let's see. Come on. There we are. Okay, cool. Oh boy. So one of the things I need to do... Did I just finish that? I finished that OST too. That's interesting. because I like the Omega Dimension way too much. Pudding is bad. Why is pudding bad? What did pudding ever do? Who are you? What have you done with my sister? What? Oops. Well, at least I know where I need to put that. There we go. This is going to be absolutely great. Meanwhile, all the moderators that are on are going to be like, oh god. Only the moderators know what just happened. wrong. <laughs> Just like Kurame, I did nothing wrong. Yet to kill something.
How many of these do I need to do? I think about five or six. Last one's a bit off that. So how does this look right now? That's actually starting to look pretty nice. Can I burn the pudding? What? What? Neptune does not burn pudding. Nepgear, you might want to you might want to consider something here. I think something is wrong with the assists. Oh, I need to figure. Oh God, I didn't think about something here with this. What was this? This was the outer ring, I think. Nope. Yeah, it was this. Fuck <laughs> yeah, I think it's a faker. With the way with the way that one's talking? Yeah, I think so. I think I realize I need to fix this here. Alright, this is base white, I think. Yes. Specular. Emissive. Oh, I see why.
said missile there again, did it? What the heck? Oh no. Oh, okay, I see why. Yeah, it's not gonna work that way, so I need to match this color. Except I can't, that's interesting. Oh, because I'm not using the right color. Yeah, that's flat though, that's not what I want. It does. That fixes that problem a bit. I right, see you, Luger. Trying to figure out what is causing some problems here. There is an exclusion. No. Because my problem I'm having right now is the fact that this isn't doing what it's supposed to do. Let's see if I can figure out why. Alright, I'm gonna actually gonna I'm gonna do this real quick then. Kill this. I'm gonna go ahead and save this. Bet if I save it this way, that way I can test and see if I can figure out what's going on here. Because I'm not, I know it's something to do with, it's the texture settings I need to figure out, but at the same time I need to figure out how to get it without causing this problem. Comments, I'm not exactly sure what's causing the rest of this to kind of blend that same emissive, which I don't want.
this one. These two are separated. <laughs> Game over. Yep. I'm trying to figure out what exactly I can do to get this to show. This might be something I learned today, because I don't see how these are going to ever come together. This chess attendance reminds me of the old days. You mean seven, like, five to six months ago, Lugia. That was back when I was barely in the double di I was, like, halfway through the double digits. Probably into the hundreds by then. Remember those days? this to be weird. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to tweak the model to kind of fit this zone specifically. Because that's gonna cause a problem otherwise. Changed, huh? Well, the original four. We should say the original four oracles. That was the day. There we go. <laughs> Smug. Oh, this is fitting. Perfect. go back and fix this then. the same problem I'm going to run into there. Is if we can... That's a darker variant, isn't it? Yeah, that's a darker variant. So speculate. Whoa, specular is not blue. So 
suspect they're probably gonna follow more of a darker. Yeah, right there. Same. Look. Uh, let's put a one in there. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it kind of looks like it. It's actually starting to... <laughs> that's just starting to kind of gain the, uh... What it needed. I remember this bit. <laughs> My RNG struck for the first time here. I got that double rare mob encounter and I would did I would, I just could not process what just happened. Yeah, I'm going to need to redo some of the modeling cuz if I want to hand paint this and I want to f be able to follow the specularity that I've got going right here for this alone. Like this is going to be a problem because the specularity doesn't match with its original one. Because if it ha if it was specular, this will match. But wow, that is that is orange. That is very orange. So yeah, I'm gonna have to go back and fix this. That's a bummer. That is a bummer. Hmm. <sighs> oh my goodness. So yeah, what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to do some edge loops. Either either do it one of two ways. Edge loop it and kind of custom build each of the the faces on this um, on the, this part specifically and maybe back here as well. So that way um, I don't have to worry about f trying to fix the lines like this here. I'll have to redo this bit too. But it looks like, I, I i mean, it's not too difficult at this point. But I'm going to have to go back and do some minor, minor tweaks here and there. That is really orange. <laughs> that is the right orange, though, which is amazing. I managed to hit that orange. Orange? To just go New England. Where's the lamb sauce? <laughs> All right. That still is a pretty good start, though. Like, it looks pretty good. I just wish I had a few more pieces that I... I like, I, I didn't have to worry about that problem. It's a bummer I have to, though. Darn it. Oh, man. It looks great, though. The model is actually rather relatively sleek, and the design's well done. I also realized this needs to be extended outward. It's supposed to be sticking out from over here. So yeah, I gotta go redo the model a bit. So that's good to know. Alright. A <laughs> disgruntled has revealed his true form. A disgruntled New Yorker. Oh god. Alright, so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and call it, because it is pretty much time. Um, I'm going, uh, Tuesday, when I work on this again, I'm going to go back into Blender and kind of polish out. I'm going to shrink this bit here. Actually, you know what? What I need to do here, oh my goodness, I'm so used to the other layout. <laughs> I need to go here, I need to custom, basically custom carve right here. 
just kind of tweak and move these, uh, basically the boxes around to make that curve I'm looking for. Over here, I need to do the same thing. That way I don't have to worry about the, uh, what is it, the black and against yellow as much. I'll probably have to do the same thing up here for the blue, and as well as here with the blue. In the words of Congo, shit. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Um, right here, I think I'll be fine. There's a there's a bit of white here that splashes. I'll have to do this thing here with blue, and I might as well go ahead and do this bit. Um, let's. This. Oh, nope, nope. This. There we go. So what I need to do is I need to just extend it. Oops. Yeah, that's what I thought. So yeah, I need to go, I'm gonna go ahead and extend this. Thanks, man. There's still a few tweaks I need to fix. But for the most part, I am actually very happy with where it is. Uh, I gotta get back into this. Oh my goodness. What I need to do is not grab this. Oh, okay. No, I see what I need to do. No. Grab these. Nope. Grab these faces. Grab these faces. Grab these faces. Whoops. Blender, please! I'm not exactly sure how I did this with Blender. Should be well I need. That's not what I wanted. Oh well. That worked anyway. 
I need these edges. Fix this model right here. Whoops. Whoops. Normally I would control loop, the, I would just grab the loop, but this is one of those weird positions where it's not capable of being done, I think. Famous last words. too many selections. Curses. Nope. Actually, I think this is all I need. No, I need this. Okay. Yep. Yeah, that seems about right. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and save this here. So I'm gonna have to do so. Like I said, I'm gonna have to do some serious tweaking to the model if I want to do it this way, which I probably should. Since, uh, let me see here. <laughs> Since I, you know, it's, I think the painting would be more fun to do this way. So I really got to do some clever, uh, workarounds. Whoops. See, all I'd have to do here, which I might just do this now, 
is just extrude this and then scale it in again. Except here, I just make this white. Do that. There we go. That solves that. That solves this lip. And then I've already said what I need to do here, here, and here. So, all right. Let's go ahead and make sure it's saved. It's good to go. I'll go ahead and leave it on the other one because this it looks so much better here. Not fully finished, but it's all, it's along the way already. But anyway, guys. <laughs> anyway, what's going on here? <laughs> you know, even Fox Anime, let, let's make you a new moderator. I'll disagree. Oh, okay. Hawks vids are one of the few times YouTube recs, well, recommended, were useful. Because too big responsibility. Oh yeah, Sage, agreed. Once. <laughs> For once, they or, uh, were something I wanted to see. These desktop. Yep, that's my desktop. Well, it's only one of them. There's two of them. But, yep, I got plenty of stuff on here. I probably should organize my... Oh, they got shuffled around again. Okay, well, not these ones. These ones probably got shuffled around because I had a screen this direction. But anyway, I think this is, like... Even though I have a few problems... This turned out quite... Nah, hang on, hang on. Where is it? It should be base yellow, I think, here. No, base white. And layer 4. Like, even though I had a few problems, this still turned out... It still turned out pretty dang good. I'm really content with this. I wish I could... I didn't have to deal with these minor problems. But... I think it's fun. This is definitely this definitely was a good run for my first time back into Blender after I think two three months. But I'm glad I still have it. <laughs> then again, if I I couldn't be a, an uh, animator slash modeler if I had this problem. So yeah, I think Tuesday I'll come back to this and see if I can make the tweaks necessary to get this thing back the way it should be. Because I think it really neat. Once we can get that going, it'll be amazing to look at. And the nice thing is, it's pre-rigged. It's a static model. All someone needs to do is just work with this with this uh, rotational point, which should be pretty easy to do, considering this right here should be where the hand is, so it'll follow the hand really well. Because it should it'll rotate based on where the hand is. I think. That, might, that should be where it should rotate. What makes the most sense? But yeah. Alright. <sighs> anyway, guys. <laughs> I'm actually... I, I'm, I'm kind of glad I got the chance to go back and do modeling. I'm kind of glad I, I got to do this again, so... <laughs> I guess it is part of my channel anyway, so it is important. By the way, Hockey, where is my request? Did you finish it? Um, which one was that? The bl oh, the blade. Uh, I lost how many? I think I lost like ten. Not ten percent. About a while back ago, I think I mentioned this. Um, I had a Windows update, and when that update hit, for some reason, Blender did not want to cooperate, or my graphics card. I don't know. Something didn't cooperate. And I lost about 15 to 75% on my Blender files. The hat will come after, uh, the, after this. Once I get this one done. I wanted to do this one just so I can get a warm-up back into things. That way I feel comfortable trying to do the hat again. So yes, I lost Fantasy, Fantasy Zone, so I need to redo Fantasy Zone. I lost, uh, how many did I lose? I lost way too many. Give me one second. Let me see which ones I still have. Here they are. All right, let's see. I lost Chomsky. I lost my uh, Rim's Mace. I lost the Master Sword. I lost uh, the Scissor Blade. And I believe I also lost uh, not the Curse, the Musket. I lost the Musket. 
I lost a lot of them. So it was about 50% to send it. No, it's about 50%, actually. Now I'm looking at how many I have. So actually, what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and grab... Um, where is it? I lost it. I lost it. Where is it? There it is. Look with Holy Blade. I'm going to yoink this. Place it here. And I'm going to grab... Where is it? Where's Alex's thing? Where is Fantasy Zone? I don't see it. Okay, well, we're going to write that one back up. So those ones are now back in the loot, or not the loot, yeah, back in the loop, yeah. Well, I was going to say loot pool, I was like, wait, that's not what I meant. Um, oh no, <laughs> I found it, I actually put it back, it already was in the loop, it was underneath the, fin it was underneath the Badan's hat. So it was already there. So I will, uh, Zachram, your, or Zachram and Nepgear, I believe your request is back in. Never forget our meme lord creations, of course. I'm just sad that I lost them. I wish I didn't have to, you know, be the whole, now I gotta go redo them, but, you know. I guess that the better thing is, when you get to do it a second time over, you kind of know what you're looking at and how to kind of solve it. So I guess that's going to make things, uh, hopefully, a little bit better. Although the fantasy world, uh, fantasy zone props were definitely unique for me to work on. So I'll see if I can do anything with those in particular, but... Anyway, all right, guys. I've <laughs> I've definitely hit time now. So <laughs> anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm, it seems like you guys all did, and I'm glad you all do. I actually want to keep this a series of things, so I think Tuesdays and Thursdays will be back to this. But um, anyway, that'll be it for tonight. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you on the next live stream or video. I'll see you guys again in the near future. Like, favorite, and subscribe! I'm kidding, don't do that!